Good morning. That shower is amazing. All right, we're just uh, just packing up to leave. Final day in Amsterdam. Our flight isn't until half seven. Is it half shower? Yeah. Half seven tonight. Um, it's only the morning time here in Amsterdam, so effectively we've got all day. But yeah, excited to get out there today. Oh. Right, we're done in the room, we're just going to go down and check out down in reception, taking the laptop with me, because I need to finish uploading yesterday's vlog. Okay, so we're pretty much uploaded, just about, just about. We're probably halfway through, but we're going to go into the city now, because exploring this city in my last day is more important than getting the vlog up right now. Just waiting on the tram. It's probably the final time we're going to venture down here for this little trip. And that makes me quite sad because I've enjoyed my time here. Little boats going by as we speak. It's just so pretty, it's so picturesque. The weather's been amazing. It's honestly so beautiful and I don't really want to go home. I'm going to miss it. I just wish I had an extra couple of days. It's a really friendly city, this place. Everyone is just really welcoming and really friendly. It's amazing. Uh, so we're going to Anne Frank's house now. Um, so we're just going to wander through the city and get up there and see what that's about. Busy. All right, so just outside Anne Frank's house, we're going to go in this one here. <laughs> this one. We've just had an argument vlog. <laughs> this... Welcome to the real world. <laughs> this one. It's not all. <laughs> it's not all laughs and stop? giggles. Please, please stop. This one here got up at eight o'clock this morning to join the queue online. While well, someone was sleeping. Basically, what you have to do to get tickets for the Anne Frank, they come available at nine o'clock in the morning, but you have to queue online before, so when it's nine o'clock comes, you open up a certain amount of tickets, and you get your tickets, but basically 8.40, prime time. 8.40, apparently, there we go. Heard it from, heard it from an experienced person. <laughs> so we're going into, we're going into a house now, looking forward to it. It should be good, it should be um, very interesting. So we're not allowed to film in there, um, but it was a really good experience, and it was very interesting. You know, she was almost like doing daily vlogs. Um, she was just writing a daily diary every day and just to see sort of how that worked in obviously a wartime when she's effectively being hunted was really quite interesting. Um, so yeah, no, it was good. It was quite sad though. Like it was very real. Like it really resonated actually how real it was and you know, they, they done a really good job actually, the museum in the house of, of trying to portray what actually happened. We're now going on a canal cruise just to soak up the last bit of, of this city before we get some dinner and head off to the airport later. So we're going on this boat just here. Sat right at the back. Look at this. I've got a little beer on the go. Thanks guys. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you. See you later. Thank you very much. Cheers, buddy. Soaking up the city one last time. No better way to do it than a little canal ride 
Um, I'm going to go up now and get some food and collect the suitcase before sadly heading to the airport. Space cakes. Cannabis chocolate. Cannabis tea. Muffins. Cookies. Cannabis gums. Cannabis lollipops. All right, so we've came into this little, uh, just like an Italian sort of restaurant. We're just, um, we just ordered some food. Our flight's in like two and a half hours, so not a mad rush, but we've just got to watch our time. That's it for us in Amsterdam. We've got, got the suitcase, heading back to the station now. Sad times. Check these things out. Sitting here. How cool is this? I mean, you're supposed to put money in the machine, like, and then it does that. But I've got to go and catch a flight now. Ah, okay. Just leaving Amsterdam. My plane is boarding as we speak right now, so I've got to make this quick. I'm going to really miss this city. Two reasons I'm going to miss this city. One of my two favourite things about this city is the number one, how small it is. That sounds strange coming from a city, but it is really compact. You can get anywhere in the city, like top to bottom, side to side in half an hour, and it's got everything like so like bunched up. Second thing I really like about Amsterdam was the people. The people were amazing. So helpful, so kind, so friendly. Good job, Amsterdam. I'm going to miss you, but I will be back. I've got to go board my flight. Right, I'm about to take off. I'm going to go for a sleep because I'm really tired. I will see you back in the UK. Okay, here's the situation. Just touched down in the UK. Those of you that have been watching the vlogs will know that Char's car broke down on Sunday when we were leaving to go to Amsterdam. We then put it in a garage to get fixed. Luckily, they fixed it. Uh, the garage is now closed. So basically, uh, the mechanic is going away, but he's getting his friend to come out to give us the keys, and then we're giving him the money. All very confusing. However, we've still got to get to the car, which is like 20 minutes from here. So we're hoping that there's some taxis outside. Let's go. Yeah. That was really easy. You just put in where you want to go in those little machines and pay for it in there and then you come out to the to the taxi right now. Exactly what I need right now. <sighs> okay. Thank you. There's a car. This uh this brings back memories. Alright, we're back in we're back in the car, back in the car park where it all happened. It was that road down there that I was pushing the car up and down for about 45 minutes. <laughs> 4 three days ago at 4 a.m. Never mind. And then we just literally threw it into that car parking space over there. We're not actually going home tonight. We're going to um, Charlotte's get some family down down in London. So we're going to actually go and stay the night with them because we're heading into London tomorrow. Um, so that'll be cool. Right, so we've arrived at Shara's family's house. We've just gotten to bed after such a long day. I'm really tired. We're about to start editing today's vlog. And then I'm gonna go to sleep. Busy day again tomorrow. We're going down to London. Thanks for watching. Until next time, take it easy. Much love.